Hockey and tennis, two sports maybe a lot of golfers don't play, but if you look at it, two of the best areas for where some of the celebrities have gone after their career have come from hockey and tennis into golf. Why, why would that be true? Well, if you look at a hockey player, they get their stick, they go to hit their slap shot, all their energy is severely loaded onto that front leg. They have got so much pressure on the front foot that when they go to shoot their puck, everything is exploded off their front leg. They're using maximum force to push off the ground to generate everything coming off that front leg. A tennis player goes hit that forehand, they're loaded up. They've got their center so far loaded up over their back leg, when they go to hit that forehand, everything is being shifted with all their weight. Common denominator there is a lot of power coming through that shift, a lot of energy being thrust forward and around your body, just like the golf swing. Mike Adams has done a great job with some research that shows us how we should load our front leg, being a little more centered, or our back leg, which most golfers I think are. You find your natural way to load and you mimic what the hockey or the tennis player has done and you get that full energy of the weight going through, so much untapped power there. Some of the hockey players hit the golf ball so far just because they've known how to maximize their energy. So if you've got any inclination to play one of those two sports, mimic what that can do and transfer into your golf swing. Feel the weight shift and the energy move through the shot, creating tremendous force, consistency, so your body and club work together as one.